Man, this is a clear cache in two different ways for your Xbox console in 2024. Now, the first thing you want to do, guys, for the first method is turn off your Xbox console completely. You want to make sure it's completely off before you even switch all power off to it, because if you do that, you're going to stuff up your Xbox console. So wait until the light stops flashing. As you can see, it's still flashing, and now it's completely stopped. So what I'm going to do now is turn it off via the PowerPoint, and what this will do, guys, is you got to leave it off for at least a couple of minutes. This will kind of like let your console reboot and rethink and clear the cache, but there's still a few more steps involved. You've got to wait at least one to two minutes, and once that time has passed, what you can do then is you can obviously flip all the power back onto the Xbox console. Just leave it for a little bit. I'll wait like a minute for power to be able to surge back into the console, because if you turn it on sh straight away, it's going to not work as fast as you can see. I'm doing it straight away pretty fast, and I'm turning on my TV straight away. It didn't come off my Xbox console at first. It just had a black screen, so do be warned. Just wait a couple of minutes and let power get back into those devices now once it's completely turned back on what you want to do now guys is you want to restart your xbox console so once you restart your xbox console it's just going to give it a fresh boot and clear the cache completely and once it's obviously turned back on that means it's completely worked and your cache has been reset and cleared but if it hasn't worked for this method there is another method you can do for this to be able to work and which i'm about to show you in a couple of seconds now for the second method guys what you want to do first is head all the way over to your xbox settings and once you're in your settings you want to head down to system then click on console info then one year in here you want to click on reset console now the option you want to click on is reset and keep my games and apps you don't want to click reset and remove everything because what this will do is remove everything and completely factory start your whole xbox console if you just press reset and keep my games and apps this will like avoid that problem but do be warned you will have to add back all your xbox accounts onto this xbox console it won't delete them it'll just remove them so you have to sign into all your accounts again in order to fix this problem and then you'll have your accounts again on your xbox console also, do be warned about that specifically, but um, once you've done that, your cache should be cleared completely and that should fix that problem. But guys, if you enjoyed today's video, make sure you go ahead and smash that like button, guys, and make sure you also go ahead and smash that subscribe button because I really do appreciate your support. And if you have any more questions or tutorials you want to see down in the comment section below, let me know down in the comment section below because I'm willing to help you guys out. Now, let me know, guys, and I'll f***ing catch you all in the next video.